This elevator is out of order. Sorry. If it's out of order, why are you here? Out of order for Carrie Uridine's guests, too? He's expecting me. In that case, enjoy your evening. Decent show. Now that that's behind us, what's Carrie Uridine's next mission? Hit on Kovacek? Very funny. But yeah, not about to let him get away with it. Maybe not today, maybe not tomorrow. But the bastard's gonna regret making me sign those papers. You try to get out of that deal with the label? Ah, let's be real. Say I break contract. Then what? Who's gonna release my new tracks? Who's gonna deal with distribution, promotion, influencers, media? Labels have got them all in their pockets. You're out with them, you're out, period. Well, you'd be free. Seriously? Free to sing until you're blue in the face, nobody hearing a thing? It's just another kind of cage. Show you one of my favorite spots in Night City. Don't come here often, but when I do, it's important. Should I feel special? Maybe. Told him to shut the place down for the day. <sighs> Can't get enough of this view. Love looking at this city from above. Well? Only place you fall asleep thinking you're special, then wake up knowing you're no one. Wow. Sometimes I wonder if I'll ever see anything more beautiful. I have. 
Doesn't matter, though. Night City's not something you ever forget. It just doesn't let you. What do you mean? Come on, I can tell something's wrong. Keep thinking about our conversation at Caliente. Us cracks, you and the slaves to the Corpo grind. Mm -hmm. Guess I wasn't completely honest with you. Or myself, for that matter. Talk to me. See, thought I was afraid everybody think me another Corpo slave. But I was just afraid I'd be in someone's shadow again. Again? Lived in Johnny's for years. Part of the scenery, machinery. Helping him shine brighter. Never believed I'd make it on my own without Silverhand. That why he left Samurai. Fuck. Johnny figured you chickened out. Couldn't take the pressure, so you left Samurai. Yeah, I know. But he was wrong. Decided to start fighting for myself. Still keeping that up. Night City's a city of shadows. Done everything I could to walk clear of them for years. Fuck. I still got a lot to prove to this city. But you? You're at the top. The city's yours. So what's there to be afraid of? Yeah, we'll talk about this again someday. Once you're in my shoes. Think it's in the cards for me? I'm sure it is. Uh, we should get back. Coming downstairs is waiting. For you. I know, I know. In the knockback a few to this town tonight. And me in it. But I'm gonna stay up here a bit longer. Go ahead. Okay. See you.
動しているようですもちろんですわかりました I saw more of those freaky murals. Did they start making sense? Tell any sort of story? All just a bunch of tarot cards. I'm pretty sure my brain's now beyond repair. The tarot tells the story of a fool's journey. Show me what you found. I'll tell you what's left. Here. Hmm. You're still missing two arcana. Judgment and the devil. My guess is that they relate to a turning point in your life. One that's soon to arrive. What's this judgment about? One possible future. Of redemption, transition, awakening. The angel with the trumpet symbolizes the end of an era. And the call to rebirth. To a new beginning. Rather not run into the devil. Got a feeling he's bad vibes. That's the card of primal, dormant desires, but also the will to survive. Hmm, doesn't sound so bad, actually. It also represents a false world, the trap these desires lay for you. What's up with the wandering fool? The fool is you and Silverhand. You've traveled a long road together, discovered your potential. And where are we headed? Your destination is the world. The final Arcanum. Both of you waged a war on the world. So there are two possibilities. Declare victory, or make peace. Could lose the war, too. Yes. Unfortunately, that's true. <laughs> thanks. Didn't get much of that, but... Thanks. You'll understand when the time comes. I can't explain everything. 
All the tarot can tell me is that you will reach the world by one of four paths. Meaning? The final leg of the journey goes through the sun, the star, temperance, or the devil. Could just die, not even get that far. Oh, come on. You won't let that happen. Take this. That's all I can do to help. Good luck, V. On whatever road you choose. Hey, Misty. I happen upon some more murals. A little different, these. Can't say exactly how, just different. Hmm. Describe what you saw for me. So, um, saw a hooded figure, star, pentagram behind him. Devil's dealings, your area of expertise, too? Hmm. The King of Pentacles. Having dealings of your own with one who's built a rich, powerful realm through sheer determination. Someone like that. Dangerous, Fee. World looks different from atop a throne. Your reign is constantly under threat. Hmm. <laughs> Rather deal with satanic shit, honestly. Saying I gotta be on my guard? I'm not sure simple caution's enough. Bad fate's stronger than that. But follow your heart, I always say. Even in defeat, you'll remain true to yourself. So there was this figure seated, holding this thingamabob, like a club or a scepter or something? The King of Wands? So that suggests you've met a leader who sticks to his principles in pursuing his aims, or even some grand vision. Okay, good or bad? Well, as ever, it depends on you. The King of Wands suggests fresh opportunities, the discarding of old patterns or habits. But it implies a certain danger, too, of ruthless action and shortcuts taken. And in the end, it could demand a sacrifice towards fulfillment of some great expectation. Saw this figure sitting there with... Dunno. A goblet, maybe? Ah. The King of Cups. Oh, be especially careful with anyone you've met who this card might be pointing to. Well, gotta be careful with everyone I meet these days. On one hand, the King of Cups signifies understanding, emotional balance. On the other, he's the opposite. Manipulation and spiritual crisis. And V, hun, the last thing your spirit needs is even more chaos and disappointment. So, we saw a guy wielding a pair of swords. Mmm, you've met the King of Swords. One of my personal favorites. <laughs> something good? Well, the King of Swords sees clearly and is a strong voice of reason. But when emotions run high, even reason can't always rise above the jazz. His truths are often sharp, painful to hear. Some would rather cover their ears, live a lie, if only to avoid suffering. Sheesh, you're a real chew, Misty. Thanks. Great insights. Still not sure what to make of what I saw, though. Well, I think you're caught between strong personalities. Boring ones, even. They all want to influence you, though not all of them necessarily know it. <laughs> Nothing new there. Don't dismiss it, V. You've got new possibilities to explore, new paths to tread. On the way to either your salvation or doom. The choice is still yours, though. You still shape your life, your fate. So what do I do? What's the right path? Just be true to yourself, V. Your heart will know the way. A life-changing event is likely imminent. Watch for it closely. was so expensive. Now they're embarrassed because he was jack shit.
How's it going with Mama Wells? Pretty good. Maybe too good. Well, how's that? After we said goodbye to Jackie, she invited me over. We talked for a while. Now, not a day goes by when she doesn't call. Ask how it's going. Tells me about herself, Jackie, everything. Sometimes for hours. Sent me a roast the other day. You believe that? Apparently I'm too skinny. She knows I don't eat meat. V, I'm afraid she's trying to, I don't know, adopt me somehow. What's the big deal? I wish somebody would make me a roast. I think Miss Wells is using me to avoid thinking about her son's death. With a new surrogate daughter. Exactly. You ever run into a guy who calls himself a Zen master? No, but I've heard of him. He try and give you some meditation BDs? Uh-huh. Then he disappeared. All I found was his clothes. And that worries you. I thought I was seeing things at first, but if other people saw him... He usually only appears right before someone dies. <laughs> Just kidding. No idea who that guy is. But I don't think a little meditation would hurt, either. Any case, if you see him again, send him to me. You want to meditate too? No, I want to read his tarot. You want to read my tarot? Sure thing. The chariot. You're ready for change. Ready to seek the truth about yourself. And to help, you'll have... Someone from your family? The sun reversed. You'll meet some obstacles, but they will be temporary. So long as you follow your own judgment. Stick to your chosen path. Strength. Strength of will, discipline, and courage will always be rewarded. But not necessarily at your destination, as the reversed magician shows. Perhaps the path itself is what's important, and will help you overcome your fear? You want to read my tarot? Sure thing. Hey, Misty. Happen? <laughs> Thanks, Misty. I guess. Still gotta wrap my head around this. You know where to find me if you need any help, V. Thank <laughs> you. 
Chinguji. Doesn't Jillian Jordan get herself fitted out here? We try to protect our client's privacy, but I'd be lying if I said no. I always wondered what it feel like to spend a ludicrous amount of eddies on threads. And you come to the right place. Welcome to Jinguji, an oasis of Bangu for those who crave perfection.
Welcome to Jinguji. Ah, look who it is. What a lovely surprise. I'd almost forgotten that pretty face, and what a pity that would be. Welcome back to our little oasis of elegance. Now, what can I do for you today? Maybe a little upgrade, hmm? Sequins are back, you know. Looking a little empty these days. What can I say? Jinguji is about quality, not quantity. Now, just between the two of us, a touch of elegance can go a long way. Guards, get the door! Hold him there! I'm sounding the alarm! Hold on! Fuck V, get down, he's whack! Backstack! Be here in a moment! Hold him! Hold him till he gets here! Talking to me? Don't let him kill me! Max Tech, thank God. Keep it up! Target neutralized. Secure the witnesses. Just had to go play dutiful consumer in a corpo suit. Can Shut hear down. you, remember? How could I forget? You! Over there! Statements, now! Finally. Just have to mop this gunk up. We'll be back in business. Situation resolved. Deactivate alarm. Sit. Hands where I can see him. In accordance with Article 105 of the Cyberpsychosis Procedure Code, your statements will be recorded and retained. Melissa Rory, Max Tax Senior Officer, please state your name and occupation. Zane Jagger. I work for Jinguji, an oasis of elegance. It... Sorry, habit. V. Merck. Occasional client of Zane's. Johnny Silverhand, rock legend, voice in V's head. Oh, fuck and also, Johnny. Let me pretend I exist sometimes, okay? Checks out. Please describe what happened starting from the moment of the attack. I was just presenting V with a one-of-a-kind offer when I... I suddenly heard shouting from the street. Zane was trying to sweet-talk me into some sparkly secret shit. Psycho storms in. Kill. Watch hey, the hustle. Fuck it, he slaughtered my guards! Zane hits the alarm, locks us in with the fucker. Thanks, Zane. Mr. Jagger followed the correct security protocol. He significantly reduced the assailant's range of effectiveness. Yeah, noted. Play cat and mouse around the whole range of effectiveness before you lot showed up. Anything else? Unusual behavior? Besides slicing and dicing my people in this store's reputation? No, nothing at all. Thank you for your cooperation. That is all. Coroner's been notified. Be here any minute. Jagger, this store is closed until the investigation is complete. Hey V, once we clean this place up, come by whenever you like. I'll handpick something special, just for Smith, you. Smith, report. Thanks. How's it looking? Later, Zane. Two killed, two wounded inside the store, six bodies on the street outside. Where's the coroner? Sitting in traffic. Be a little late. Nice work. You feel that back there? Feel his life leave his body? Hold up a sec. Your mantis blades. Higurashi 2013s. Weren't those pulled off the market in 69? Recall they don't play well with neural processors. Poking a part of the prefrontal cortex they shouldn't be poked at. Probably would have bought a pair myself weren't for that. Good eye. Had them installed years ago. They're very... precise. Huh. Thought Magstack preferred our soccer blades as their standard issue. But, well, seeing how you handle these wrist razors... They're my... reminder. When I see them, I see what they've sliced. Muscle, tendon, bone, even implants. Like a hot knife through butter. But you're with the good guys now, right?
You always just wipe them? You know, herd therapy can sometimes work. Apprehending the target alive carries additional risk for bystanders. Rarely done. Very rarely. Rarely? <laughs> More like never. How many psychos you save in your life? Don't change the subject. You felt him die. Did you... like it? That split second when the blood still flows, but his light's gone out?
can't hide. You know that. How's biz? Can't complain. People in Night City rather die of hunger than walk around with last gen iron. Looking for some fresh iron? Look no further, I've got you covered. Tied on gear? This is a North Oak, as you can see. But as many of my clients say, it's better than nothing. Need some ripper work done. Uh-huh. Let's have a look then, shall we?
Appreciate it. Thanks.
Well, well, well. Nice. I had something similar, but none of that nomad shit. Mm-hmm. Let me guess. Big busty blonde on the side? First, beg your pardon. And second, brunette. Shit. No fixing this. What's wrecked is wrecked.